Hi, my name is Gene Gableman. I'm the director of golf at Kissing Camels at the Garden of the Gods Club, and I'm here with, to share with you a few ideas to improve your game. In this segment, we are going to give you some tips to help you get out of the bunker more effectively. The first thing that we want to discuss is that we have to have the club face open. Uh, I'm using a 60 degree wedge. Some people use a 56 degree or a sand wedge, but the, the wedges are designed with bounce on the bottom of them. So uh, you lay the club on its back or with an open club face. The purpose of that is so when the club enters the sand, it actually planes through the sand and bounces back up. If your face is square, it's going to dig in the sand and it's going to stick. It's not going to bounce through the sand. When you open up your club face, you also must open up your stance. So you are going to be pointed left of your target line. Now, when I, when I enter in to hit the golf ball, I always dig my feet in. And everybody always wonders why they see folks digging their feet in. Well, there's a couple different reasons. Number one is to get stability when you're in the sand. But number two, a great tip is when you are digging your feet into the sand, feel the ground that's underneath your sand, it, underneath your feet. Is it hard or is it soft? It'll give you an idea of how your club is going to bounce through the sand because you can't take a practice swing in the bunker. So, lining up. I'm pointed a little bit left of my target. I've dug my feet into the sand. I put the ball either in the middle of the stance or slightly back. I have the club face laid open. And when I go to make the swing, I go very, very vertical. And I try to knock all the sand out of the bunker two inches behind the ball to two inches in front of the ball. The other tip is to always finish your golf swing. The last thing you want to do in the sand is to swing through and decelerate and have your club stop. Always finish your swing. Thank you for watching these ideas on improving your game. We have PGA and LPGA instructors at Kissing Camels. Please contact the golf shop if you'd like to expand upon what we've taught you today. And if you're interested in the club or in membership at the Garden of the Gods Club, please call Tracy Collada.